Guys, trust me, um, any couples that, that want to get away, this is a 10 out of 10, 11 out of 10 spot, man, trust me. Like, it's pure couples here. I must be the only single person here. <laughs> it's pure couples here, yeah? Um, having a great time. Loads of restaurants, bars, lovely beach. There's not much else going on for other people, but for couples, it's brilliant. Trust me. You should get over it. Don't even cost that much. I, um, I'm here for a week, but I'm staying at this park for four days. And it cost me, because I get discounts and stuff, um, I only had to pay £57 I had to pay <laughs> to stay here for four nights, um, which is fuck all, you know, and um, oh shit, and instead of paying £55 to come here straight from England, I stopped at Bulgaria um, because it was only £11 to go to Bulgaria and £13 from Bulgaria to come to here, and only £13 for me to stay in Bulgaria for two nights. So it was cheaper for me to go to Bulgaria and stop there for two nights and, and then come here than just to come here straight from England. So yeah, you can get if you can literally book now and go to Bulgaria for two nights, then come here for a few nights and go home and it only cost you a hundred pounds. I'm telling you. <laughs> so yeah, get on it guys. I'm sure you've all had enough of England. <laughs> Just finishing my cigar, then I'm gonna go for a swim. I need to go and put my phone back. Oh fuck, every now and then a wave comes and it goes up to the bit of me that's dry and it's freezing. <laughs> I'm in up to my waist now anyway, so I'm near enough fully in, you know what I mean? I'm ready to bathe in now. It's not as cold once you're in the water. But at first it's fucking freezing, oh shit. I'm trying to sh I don't know if you can see up there. See the pink building? That's my hotel up there. The horrible pink colour. It's actually a decent hotel, actually. But it's um, just a horrible colour. But from my room, I can't see the sea. But I've got a lovely view, though. Still. I've got a view of the mountains and that, you know? And the views of the mountains around here are spectacular. I'm not going to lie. So hold on, I'm trying to read your messages, I ain't got my glasses on. And five grams for 20. <laughs> Who said that? <laughs> I don't know about the weed here, man. Um, weed's illegal here, but they um, the CBD weed is legal. And they sell it in the shops. I think they, yeah, I think you get seven grams for 20. It, actually, it is five grams for 20, but you get extra two, two grams. So it's seven grams for 20 euros, yeah, basically. Yeah, I feel nice now. Cool down a bit, you know. Just gonna plop my phone down and go back in the sea. So I'm gonna have to love you and leave you guys. Maybe I need to invest in a waterproof phone. <laughs> but yeah, as soon as you come out of the water, baking hot. But right, I'm actually wearing these shorts. I haven't put these on to swimming. I'm actually wearing them today. Um, I hope when I come out I should cool down but I'm thinking should I put my top on as well <laughs> and get that wet because it's baking yeah and I could do with some wet clothes on I swear down to cool me down I've already got my trainer soaked by the way but it's no biggie because they're drying about an hour in this sun I tell you I wanted to rent a kayak or a canoe or something and go out and about in the water, but um, I was too late. I was supposed to, just, uh, supposed to um, book it by half ten, but I got, I got there too late. So I might end up doing that tomorrow. Uh, for those of you who don't know, years ago I, used, I actually used to be a canoe instructor. So I love canoeing and kayaking and stuff like that, you know. Pretty good at it. Well, I would be. I used to be a canoe instructor, you know. <laughs> That was actually one of my first jobs about 30 years ago. <laughs> I had to swim five miles in the sea and five miles in the swimming pool. To, um, that was part of the thing to get your um, certificate to be an instructor. I can't see all your messages, guys, because the sun's on my phone and I ain't got my glasses on. Hold on one minute, I'm going to try and have a look. 
Yeah, it's CBD weed though, bro. It's all right. It's like your weed six out, six, seven out of ten in England. Yeah, um, it's all right, but it does, you know. You can get the real deal here, but it's proper undercover. Cause believe me, you get caught with anything. The real thing here, you're you're not going home. You get me? So it's proper undercover, but you. You just gotta know the right people, and if people see you smoking, they might even say to you if you need some weed. Uh, uh. But yeah, man, honestly, if you come over here, you'll get sorted. It's only a small, it's only a, it's like a little village, it's like a village, yeah? So you, you walk around and you keep bumping into the same people all the time, kind of thing, you know? So you get to see everyone. I feel like it's too hot to do anything but drink beer or all kind of sea. But anyway, I'm gonna go for a swim now, guys. Just a quick swim, just to get myself wet and cool down, you know? I might just leave my phone running, hold on. If I can plot it up here, I'll leave it running for you guys. Not that there's much to see apart from these drowning. I might drown or get attacked by a shark, you never know. <laughs> hold on. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave it like that, guys. Catch you up, go for a swim. Fucking freezing. Yeah, it's too cold, man. Hey, it's too hot out of water. It's too cold in the water. <laughs> Fuck. And I've got a mouthful of salt as well. Actually reminded me when I tasted the oysters in Portugal. <laughs> Yeah, sorry guys, I got my phone wet, man. I got my phone wet, there's all sand in it. <laughs> no buttons are working. I can't finish my live broadcast, so you're on here forever now, guys. <laughs> Fuck you know, I've got sand all over me. 
Yeah, I didn't even bring a towel or nothing. This is spur of the moment. <laughs> you get me? But, um, I don't really want a towel to dry off. But I would like to get the sand off me. Yeah, my phone's not working, so you're stuck on here forever now, guys. <laughs> I always carry a spare phone just in case. I've got a spare phone in my hotel here. Uh, literally nothing I'm pressing is working. <laughs> it is fucked. <laughs> Proper fucked. Uh, literally, I just come out to sea as you saw, yeah? What, about 30 seconds ago? The top half of me is near enough dry already. So, I'm starting to get hot again now. <laughs> yeah, my phone ain't having, having a bar of it. It got wet. Got sand all over it. I think I fucked it. <laughs> Anyone got a phone for sale? Give me a shout, yeah? <laughs> In a minute, cool down a piece. Yeah, can you guys see through the water? Can you see the bottom of the water and the fish in that? If you look, there's all little fish swimming around. Ooh, fucking cold again now. <laughs> I've dried already, my top half's dry already, man. In about 30 seconds. Well, I suppose it don't matter if I drop my phone in the water now because I fucked it already. Yeah, no, no buttons, nothing's working on my phone. So I'm stuck on live broadcast forever. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Getting out of here now. Gotta sort my phone out, man. Yeah, I'm gonna get out of here. I'm gonna go back up there, have a beer, and I'll probably come back in the beat in the water again in a bit. I don't know how I'm gonna turn my phone off. But nice one guys, enough love. I think I'm literally gonna have to switch my phone off for it to do anything. Oh that's it. Yeah, I'm gonna have to switch my phone off, guys. Yeah, I'm not sure. If I switch my phone off, I'm thinking that my video I just done won't stay on my page. Let me see if I can try it. Yeah, it's not having a bar of it, man. My phone's effed. <laughs>